Hey everyone, this is James with WS News. I want to bring you an important update here from the Gateway Pundit. The headline is, Man expertly humiliates alleged FBI agents and sends them fleeing after they show up at his house to confront him over a social media post. There has never been a more critical time in America for citizens to understand and exercise their constitutional rights. One man in New Hampshire proved this knowledge is invaluable after the Biden-Harris regime apparently attempted to turn him into a criminal. Jeremy Kaufman, an entrepreneur and libertarian political activist, was visited at his home Monday by two men claiming to be FBI agents regarding an unspecified ex post that he made. When he asked them who they are, the bald person claims he's Donald from the FBI in New Hampshire, which understandably does not satisfy Kaufman, who wants full identification. The bald man then demands Kaufman stop recording the encounter, which Kaufman refuses to do, citing his First Amendment right. He then asks the younger-looking and full-haired person for his name. He declines while also asking Kaufman to stop recording, which Kaufman again refuses. Kaufman next lays down an ultimatum. Either show me your name and ID or walk away. So the full-haired alleged agent says they want to talk while the bald man attempts to pass off his supposed badge as identification. After the bald guy finally states the purpose of their visit, which is to speak to Kaufman about a post he made online, Kaufman turns the tables on them and embarrasses them further. I want to talk to you about you guys coming here. Say you make a salary of a low 100K, factoring in 50% expenses. You're talking about burning a couple hundred of dollars here, let alone all the time you guys are spending to investigate something you know is not against the law. When the bald guy claims that they were coming to ensure there weren't any threats, Kaufman again responded with fire. No, you're coming because you're part of a regime that does this kind of thing when you know laws aren't being broken. And that's an embarrassment, man. Didn't you guys read the Constitution? Do you not believe in America? How do you do your jobs and go home? Unable to respond to these pointed questions, the supposed agents turn and begin to walk away, but Kaufman gets in his final words to them. You guys are F-heads who try to act like bullies, and I hope you go home and are embarrassed. You cannot even say your name on camera because you know what you are doing is embarrassing. You know, Americans who believe in the Constitution think you are laughable. The bald man and his partner finally vacate the scene and drive off. So you can see he shared that whole encounter right there on X. Incidents involving alleged FBI agents visiting homes over innocuous social media posts have unfortunately become commonplace in America. The Gateway Pundit has covered several examples of this abuse. Two years ago, a leading opponent of the new China-owned corn mill in North Dakota received a home visit from local police and FBI agents after posting a paragraph from the Declaration of Independence on Facebook. So I thought this was an important update here from the Gateway Pundit. Let me know what you think about it in the comments section. You know, you have these people showing up, supposed FBI agents, showing up to somebody's house because of a social media post. So let me know what you think about it in the comments. I appreciate you for taking the time to watch this, and I will talk to you soon.